YouTube to become the game room here, and we're doing Daytona 500. I did win the poll in poll day, Daytona 500. So we're gonna go racing here again. Also, I did win my dual race. That quite frankly does not matter because I won the 500. Be because I won the poll. It's not important when you win the duel. Okay. Oof! Sorry, Danny Hamlin. I didn't mean to hook you like that. Caution, caution, caution. Big crash, big crash. And yes, I do do that. I just keep wanting to the game. Yeah, that was kind of my fault. But I was trying to move up and Hamlin kind of moved down. And the big crash happened. <laughs> yeah, look at this big mess. Oh man! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> I wasn't involved in it. Okay, I'm in fifth. Nobody DNF, but Denny Hamlin lost 25 positions. <laughs> oh, wow! And Truex lost 29. So we gotta get to the front of the pack so I can do a burnout out at the end of this race. Push one, Pablo. I am pushing the PM. Okay, I like being in this view because I can actually see everything. Falling back because nobody's freaking drafting with me. Okay, rewind here. Okay. I can't believe I have to use a rewind in the middle of a let's play, but still. You gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, because call, because... Okay, yeah. Nice, I got the draft here. Wait, I don't want to push. Oops, sorry, caught bush. I'm sorry, Clint Royal. But something that I just did, that what I just did was something that Kyle Bush would probably do in real life. <laughs> okay. Probably when he realized, hey, I'm below the other line, let's whack the call in front of me. And it just so happens to be brother court. Oh no, Casey Mills. I'm forcing you below the line. There's no rule against doing that. I know I'm driving really aggressive here, but I'm a very aggressive driver in racing games, just in general. Because I like to be in the front, and I don't like to have to wait to get to the front, so I use crashes and just crash everybody. You in position? Oh my god! Nice caution. But I have to rewind because I don't see where I um, went below the line there. Cause I didn't go below the line. What the heck? I didn't do that. That's crap. Okay, I did not go below the line there. Buy retry. Yes, I'm buying a retry because that was crap. Cause I didn't go below the line though. Yes. I don't care that I have to use two thousand credits on that, but at least I got my spot back. Man, I need to draft somebody. Okay, nice. I got draft on Edwards. I can draft Edwards here. Get up on him. Slingshot around him. Okay, I'm gonna go out there. Oh, sorry guys, I did not realize that you couldn't see. Let me move that. I don't know how the camera moves by itself. Okay, that's better. Okay, we're back here. I just had to move the camera a tad bit. 
You see, we are trying to go to for Lee in the Daytona 500. I went down in forward position. Lap 5 out of 10. We're going to be halfway here soon. I think I can get the lead here. Once I get the lead, I'm pretty much well set. Nice. Fast lap. Okay, Jeff Gordon is in the lead of the Daytona 500. And I'm going to try and pass him. I know I can win this race. They have a really fast call. I'm gaining on Clint Boyle, who's going to drafting part now. So I see a checkered flag, a trophy, a PS3 trophy, and the Daytona 500 trophy in my future. And the born out. Go a little low here. I'm do I'm going really fast, but I just can't seal the deal on getting up to boil. Ooh, that wouldn't help me. Hitting <laughs> the apron that hard. Yeah, my car looks horrible. Okay, nice on me catching Clint Boyle here. This is good. If I can get Clint Boyle's draft, that's a really good situation for me. And I can a slingshot around him. My favorite movie, Outside the Inside Slingshot. You're gonna draft him? And the lead in the Daytona 500 is back to me, Kyle Busch. And no, I'm not really Kyle Busch. I, I kind of wish I would because being Kyle Busch would probably be awesome. I mean, it just has to be. You get to drive fast. Uh, you get to drive a NASCAR. You get paid a lot of money. You probably have a big house. Oof, that was not good. My car looks like a tank hit it. But I honestly don't care about how the car looks. Because we are going two laps to go here in Daytona. Here and we have the lead here. A point three second lead over Jeff Gordon. Ooh, I got high there. That was not good. Don't hit the wall because he is approaching in my mill. I see Jeffrey Gordon. <laughs> Jeffrey Gordon. <laughs> Ooh, this ain't good for me. Okay, nice. I got the lead. I got a big lead now. Ooh, that was not what I intended to do. I'm kind of losing it here. Okay, I'm going to have to pause here because my SD card is full. Okay. Okay, we're coming back here. Let me get the camera set up. Okay. Is that Daytona 500? One lap to go. Let me get up on my shell. Okay, let me try and get the camera to look good. Is that good? Now what we're going to be doing is winning the Daytona 500. That's all we're going to be doing in this little spot. Oh, oh crap, Jeff Gordon is coming. Man, he can't catch me. I have the shackled flag in sight. No, I really don't. I, I still have half a lot to go. But hey, it looks like I'm going to win Daytona. I'm probably going to win every... I'm going to probably turn the difficulty up the medium. Because this was just way too easy. I dominated this race. 
And coming to the shackled flag is me. And it's... Yay, I won Daytona. Now we're going to have a bone out. Okay, let's look at this on board. Me, I just call. That just hit the cone. Ah, oh, it cut me short. That was not nice. Okay. Okay, well, let's watch the victory celebration. I'm gonna hold the camera now. Okay, and that is the. Wow, that's a silver trophy to win the big home. Okay, this is that's the end of episode one of Let's Play um, NASCAR the Game Inside Line. And I will see you from at Phoenix.